North Korea sparks nuclear arms race as war fears rise. Kim Jong-un has rapidly increased the Hermit Kingdom's missile program in the last year, launching numerous ballistics and even a hydrogen bomb. As well as threatening the US with his huge arsenal, he has also turned his wrath on longtime enemies South Korea and Japan for siding with the Americans. This has driven both nations to consider developing their own hull of missiles. We're talking about nuclear proliferation Henry Kissinger the South and Japan fear that if war were to break out on the peninsula, the US would not risk provoking the North although Trump has pledged to defend allies from Kim. Cold War nuclear strategist Henry Kissinger told the NIT, if they, North Korea, continue to have nuclear weapons, nuclear weapons must spread in the rest of Asia. It cannot be that North Korea is the only country in the world that has nuclear weapons without the South Koreans trying to match it. Nor can it be that Japan will sit there. So therefore we're talking about nuclear proliferation. South Korean polls show 60 of people want their own nuclear missiles. And a Japanese minister earlier this year urged Shinzo Abe to renegotiate an agreement signed with the US after World War II to develop their own new arsenal. Being the only country to ever suffer a nuclear attack, the public support for nuclear arms in Japan is low, but could change if both Korean nations arm themselves. Japan is believed to sit on a stockpile of nuclear material that could power 6,000 weapons. The Tabi tyrant's most recent nuke warning was that he would fire his hydrogen bomb over the Pacific Ocean, which could be catastrophic for Japan if it is misfired. But Daily Star Online has revealed that the US is planning to shoot it down. Should it be fired overground?